Alright. I got pretty much everything put together. I got the, uh, these electronically wise. I've got the two motors, the X and Y axis, and the Z axis there. And then we got the router motor, uh, the main carving motor, and then we have, uh, on the computer here, set up the little demo. There's a little carve out saying Blake CNC. That would be kind of cool. Anyways, um, alright, we'll show you what it does. But you can see the router starts up all by itself. You can have it be able to set up to a control, be controlled by the computer. You can see all the LEDs and they're lighting up for each of the axes. And they're all spinning and whatnot. As they move along. I don't know if you can really see that. There's a green line that kind of etches out where the motor is supposed to be. So that's kind of cool. And this is how it's all going to be driven by a little nut. The nut stays still and then as it spins it will move up and down the rod. So that will be each of the axes up, down, left, right, X, Y, Z, you know. Alright. Oh and then, uh, you know, we'll just turn it back on pretend how it's supposed to be. Panic button! Everything stops. So, kind of cool. And give me yells at you. Ah, angry. Research emergency mode. All right, that's it.